How's it going everyone and welcome back to another video. So today I will be remaking one of my older videos because I'm just kind of not happy with it and I feel like I could have done a better job. And that video is how to get the King's Ransom Legendary Sword. So let's get into it. Now to start your journey you want to make sure you're at least level 25 because we'll be doing the dungeon solo and unskilled. So the monsters we'll be killing will be level 12-ish and it's going to make your time killing them a lot faster. After that, make your way to Doomwoods and follow my path. There will be a chest behind this tree which will have a quest for you to complete to get the sword. Pick up that quest. Now this sword isn't very easy to get because it requires two items which is a 0.5% chance to drop from the bosses at the end of the two dungeons located here in Doom Woods. Now to get the eye key go to this dungeon that's located to your right as soon as you spawn into Doom Woods. You want to follow this path until you find an NPC called Brother Bearson. Then enter the door right next to him. Now this dungeon is pretty simple all you need to do is kill every mob in each room until you get to the boss. Also keep an eye out for the rare chest as they might contain a quite rare sword known as Doom Ripper. A little tip, uh, you want to use something that's a very powerful range attack, so like the lucky shot cross skill, because if you get too close to the boss he will stun you for about 2 seconds which might waste your time. Kill him and hope to god he drops the eye key, if not rinse and repeat. Also the key is a quest drop, not an actual item drop, so you don't really need to loot him, but you can if you want to. Now for the wooden key, go to this dungeon that is located to your left as soon as you enter Doomwoods. You want to go here and get to this NPC called Griever. The dungeon entrance is located right behind her. Again, you're going to want to kill all the mobs in this dungeon, except for one room. If you spawn into a room looking like this, use your travel form, because we can do this room quite quickly and you don't need to kill anything. Just follow my character and click on the roots. I also check this little room just to see if a rare chest is spawned. Now the boss here has nothing special, he will not stun you but I highly recommend using lucky shot just to one shot him and hope for the wooden key. And that's it, that's how you get both keys. Again the drop rate is very low so you will be doing these dungeons quite a bit. It's a roughly 1 in 200 chance to get one key from one boss and you're gonna need two of them. I highly recommend using the berserker class because it has an ability called savage flames which is a really good aoe. It only has a 7 second cooldown which I think is one of the shortest AoE cooldowns of the classes we have at the moment. And just a note, you can also do these in any order, though the bosses will only drop their key, so you can't farm one dungeon for both keys. So that's it. Thank you for watching the video and let me know how close you are to getting your King's Ransom. I hope you enjoyed, remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.